Now, as you can see, there's a big old bonfire going on. The townsfolk are turning into beasts, but they are still hunting beasts. Pretty much the only beasts they're hunting are violent ones that attack them and you. But you're not, even though you're not a beast, they see you as one. Uh, now, down there, it's a large mob. There's two riflemen. I don't know if you can see them too well. There's a carriage to the left that has one. And back behind the bonfire, there's another one. You can just barely see them to the right of the flames. Um, this area, I find the best method is hit and run tactics. You want to use your pebbles, get the attention of a couple of them, and then back away. Uh, just trying to make sure I don't forget nothing. Oh, yes, another thing is way off back there is a dog and the dogs they're i think they're just annoying they're they're quick they do have a good little bite on them but they're they're easy to take out so i'm gonna go ahead and start another video real quick and i'll show you how i get through there Now from here, you can either go back and down onto the road and walk up towards them. Back from the original stairs. You can go down these stairs, or you can continue on down to the right. The right dead ends, but there is a break in the fence where you can drop down there. Uh, it's not a good idea to go too far down there at the moment, because uh, some of them do notice you if you get too far up ahead. Like watch, see here there comes a couple of them now. As you can see, they're all breaking apart, going to separate directions. You can see some are going back down the road, some are going off to the other side, and some just patrol the whole area. I suggest doubling back and taking out the guys that have decided to patrol back down the road. Missed. Ooh, that was close. I didn't realize I used up all my stamina. <laughs> all right, let's head back. Now the rest of the guys down there, you don't need to worry about too much. They won't come at you unless you drop down there there's an item over here and there's a guy further down let's go ahead and get the items and take him out more bullets now he is actually not facing towards you so if you walk towards him you can sneak up on him you get kind of close to him don't get too close you charge up and you get a nice little stunned attack Leading into a, vi a visceral attack. And you can see this little gate here. The gate does not open from this side. Or it does not open at all. And if you're listening, you can hear somebody's kind of pissed. Yeah, there's a big monster on the other side of that door trying to get through. But do not worry. The, the gate does hold from this side. Or it does hold and you can't get through there. Alright, so the next thing you want to do is start egging, start aggroing one or two of them and then running away, let them get them to follow you. Now, whenever you hear gunfire, roll or do serpentine maneuvers. Oh, I had too many of them on me. And I'm stuck on something. Oh, I had way too many of them. <laughs> that is why you want to use your pebble and only get Uh, 
Okay, attempt number two. Uh, you see the enemy with the glowing eyes? He has my blood echoes. If I kill him and don't die, I get them back. The blood echoes retreat. This is how you're supposed to do it. Instigate one or two of them, back away. Ooh, that was close, I almost got shot. The heck hit me? I think that bullet missed, or solid missed. Ball cleaver. Ooh, I'm stuck. Oh, crap, my second one. Yeah, I don't like how it's, uh, transformed mode is so narrow. I like having the long weapons that have wide swings. Uh, I would like using the hunter's axe, but that's just a little too slow for me. Now with those snipers, you come up to the left side, and if you can get behind this railing, you're safe. It can't hit you. All the way up to about the edge of this of this pole. Once you step to the side of it, it can hit you. Here, dog. back here and you pick up the item by the door and don't be nervous about the banging doors you'll be fine then do one quick run through to make sure you didn't miss any items once you've cleared the area come back up to where the second I can't remember if I said it I think I just picked it up without saying it but there's an item right here We'll come back to the left side where the gunman was on the carriage. And there is an open gate you can go through. 